is happening, Magnusites? So, I've seen people play with Leroy in Tekken 7 and seen them just destroying people. Destroying people. I hear the character's kind of broken. Um, can be a good and bad thing. <laughs> Let's check this out. wonder if they fix them for this one. Some pimp to Gator Pants. Yeah, I thought he was Wing Chun. Chain punches, boy. <laughs> I was just thinking about law. I was like, you know, I don't think law does a lot of traditional Wing Chun moves. Damn. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, <laughs> black dragon flew through there when he did it. <laughs> you see why people like him so much. <laughs> He's no joke. Holy shit! Woo! Woo! You know what? Um, I'm wondering. You know, a lot of times with. But there's the game and then there's the storyline. And sometimes you'll find out that certain characters, no matter how thorough they might be in the game, story-wise, they're not that powerful. I wonder where he ranks in the power. Because we all know that, you know, Kazuya's going to be upper echelon, Hihachi, Akuma, if he's even in this, um, you know, Jin. Cause they're working with some supernatural stuff or something, you know what I mean? But as far as you know, how good are they really? Do they stand a chance? You know, because you can beat the game with any character, of course. A lot of them have great moves, but then when it comes storyline, you're watching an anime about it or you know, some cutscenes, you'll find out like, damn, my character really ain't that, ain't the shit in the game, and I mean, in the story, you know what I mean? Anyway. Post comments down below. Let me know what you all thought. If you enjoyed my reaction and thoughts, make sure you hit the like button, subscribe, and share. 10 million subscribers. Woo!